Hi folks, this is Eric with Zwift Insider and I wanted to give you a quick video overview of how to use the training plans from Zwift. There's been some questions because Zwift just recently reorganized their workout library and there were folks who were using that library to go through training plan workouts and now they're confused about how to access those workouts which are only available in training plans after the reorganization. Anyway, here's how you can sign up for a training plan, browse training plans, and also cancel a training plan, which is uh, a little more confusing than it should be. Uh, so first, training plans, they're under workouts, which is this icon up here at the top left. Go to plans, and it'll bring up this window. So this is a list of all the training plans that Zwift has. It starts with cycling plans, and then you've got running plans down at the bottom. Click any plan to read details about it and click view plan to view the full plan, all the weeks, all the workouts, all that stuff. You can browse it. So let's do an example. Let's do build me up, which is the last plan I did. Man, it's a tough plan, but a good one. Uh, so if I click view plan, it gives you the summary of it. It's going to take a total of 58 hours and eight minutes of writing. Going to burn this many calories based on your FTP, current FTP, estimated distance, all that stuff. Uh, Anyway, you can click in here and browse all those workouts. If you want to enroll in the plan, just click enroll down here. So I'm going to do that. And now I'm ready to go. I'm ready to, uh, if I click workout here, it'll take me into the flow of starting a workout. I'll get to pick which route to ride and, and we'll do this, this first workout. Uh, so that's how to get in the plan. And once you're enrolled in a plan, if you pull up your Zwift companion app on your phone, it'll show you the next upcoming workout. So it kind of helps guide you through it and you can skip workouts and you can skip around on the plan if you want, but it will automatically kind of help you follow the structured plan that the coaches have laid out. Now, if you want to cancel your plan, this one's a little weird. Uh, the only way that I found to cancel a plan other than actually finishing the plan is to go back to this screen, find the plan that you're signed up for. So, hey, I'm signed up for Build Me Up. I click it. You have to click View Plan. And now this is the very unintuitive part. Uh, so it looks like this is everything that there is to the plan. You've got your, your prep stuff. Then you've got all your weeks down here at the bottom. Uh, but here's the trick there's another slide over here on the left if you click this arrow it'll take you to it or if you click and drag it'll take you to it look at that <laughs> uh, so that's where your cancel plan button is kind of goofy because like basically you don't know it's there unless you happen to uh to click left but if you click cancel plan asks you if you're sure yes i'm sure and now you're out of that plan so i hope that helps and I hope it gets you all training and uh, hitting your goals. Right on, everybody.